Lee, in the arena or in the area of guarding one's character, what's your strategy to help people to stay on course? Well, I don't have an exact recipe, mm -hmm. but I do have five C's that I use that are really helpful. First is clarity. You know, we have to clarify what it is we stand for. What are our character boundaries? How are we going to do that? It's going to be important. And secondly, to do that, we have to have commitment. Commitment means that you are committed to it and you're going to hold yourself accountable, that there's no sliding back or forth. And when you start to lose that commitment, you coach yourself right back up, back on course to stay headed in the right direction. And then I think you have to be connected in community. You know, we say that fighter pilots and Navy SEALs, Special Ops, Special Forces, Green Berets, they never fight alone. And I think you do not want to be alone in areas of character because there are times you need somebody to help you clarify, is this over the line? Does this pass the smell test? And if you're afraid to do that, then you're probably, your character is at, at risk. So I have people I go to and say, does this sound okay? When I know that I'm getting close to the line, like my CPA, you know, but friends, my wife is very big help in that. Uh, so have people that you trust that you can talk to about what you're thinking about doing. And then you have to have confidence in yourself. If you're not comfortable in your own skin, you will not be able to keep your vows to yourself about your character. So you have to be comfortable. Your self-worthiness, you have to love yourself enough to believe in yourself and to believe that you are capable of living up to your commitment to your character. And finally, it's going to take courage. We talked about that so often. We always talk about courage because courage is really the backbone of leadership. Uh, Gus Lee, who was a professor at the Air Force Academy, said that in his book, uh, Courage, the Backbone of Leadership. And I totally agree with that. It's the foundation for everything that you want to do and want to be, it's going to take courage to really be the full self that you can be. You can be that person, but you have to be so committed to it and believe that you can come through and you will. I think those five C's really work well and I rely on them a lot and I coach myself and I encourage others to do the same.